Hello again, it's uh, Joey John McGuire. I'm uh, in one of my favourite pubs, again. Uh, I'm at the Plough and Harrow, uh, a Weatherspoons pub in Hammersmith. Um, I'm just about to recite my latest poem. I've uh, been writing an awful lot of poems uh, recently. I'm very, very prolific. Uh, this poem is called uh, A Room Within a, a Room. Last week, someone led me to a room within a room. I followed him there of my accord as I searched in desperation for answers to my hideous predicament that had been dogging my life for years. To follow had taken total trust, something I do not give lightly and to few, but I knew it was time to engage the jungle of entanglement that had become my life occupied, inhabited my mind. I'm sure you can imagine the horror I felt when this person I had trusted of gentle voice and reassuring tone tossed a half dozen hand grenades into my lap and then observed me there in the room inside the room alone and fumbling my room where I'd been so many times before. He watched in silence as my man grappled for cover from the impending explosion, he alone knowing that the grenades were not armed mere placebos, with both myself and the tyrant dominating my brain unaware that war had just been declared. It was time to think outside of the box, to put my house in order, rid myself of the dreadful bondage that had made a wrestle of living. I crawled from that room, taking hours to scratch and claw my way back from exhaustion. I had been overwhelmed by the shock I had encountered. My first thoughts to ambush, ambush and betrayal, as the person I had trusted turned on me with a handful of grenades, forcing me into a battle I'd long avoided, so challenging my trust. Next week I must revisit the room, I must trust him yet again, I must put my faith in him, for there is no one else worthy of my trust, of that I know. Reflection tells me, and I have had days to reflect, that his suggestions and suppositions, the hand grenades, were catalysts to the declaration of war, and the very fact that he will be there next week tells me that we're in this battle together, I the regular, he the volunteer, and this time, for the first time, I am not alone. <laughs>